What's up guys, Red X Tech here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to put music onto your web page and make it autoplay. So yeah, the first thing you're going to want to do is get your project open. I'm using brackets for that. Uh, the next thing you're going to want to do is make a, um, is make a little, um, make your website. Make it how it wants to look first, so I just did a little basic thing here. Here's the home page that I have for it, and here's the music that I have for it. So, yeah, you, with brackets I can do a live preview, so I just have this, and on music, once it, oh. Well then, um, one sec, I can, I can fix that. There. Then I'll go to music.html and this I'll go to index.html and save that. Save that. And now in the live preview it'll work. Okay, great. So yeah, um now once you have your website layout, or it, once you have it all set up, you're gonna want to go to your video that you want to put into it as a song. So I'm going to use Pegboard Nerds and Tristam, their razor sharp song, because I really like that. And you're going to click on share, then embed, and you're going to copy this right here. And I copy. Now you no longer need that. Now on your music page, you're going to want to paste that in right there. Or where, wherever you actually want it to be, it doesn't really matter. Just paste it in anywhere on your website. Now you'll be able to see that and now save it. Now when you do your live preview, you'll be able to see that right there. But I don't want to have to click on it. So <clears throat> what do I do? I go into here and I will type question mark R E L equals zero and a u t o p l a y autoplay equals one so I just add that to the end of the link now when you open this up it'll start playing automatically but now that looks ugly and you don't want to see it now there are two things that you can do you can either put it in the style attribute of this or you can do it in your style.css page I'm gonna show you how to do both um, now, here, if you want to set it, just make it style equals, like it, uh, um, equals that, and do display equals none and enter. Now, when you live preview it, it won't show anything, because it's gone. Now say you don't want to do it in there, but you still want it to have it happen, and you, you want to use your CSS file to do it. Just type in class equals music. Or you could do ID, but I'm going to use class for this now. In style.css, or whatever you've linked your page to in that create a new class or ID depending on what you did before called music and set display to none. Now the same thing will happen. So yeah that is how you will be able to um, that is how you'll be able to play live music on your website. Or not live music, but autoplay music in the background of your website, so. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will be doing some more tutorials on how to do stuff with HTML, because I'm really getting into that and enjoying it a lot. So yeah. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, then give it a like or subscribe. I lo love that. And yeah, see ya.